You might be wondering what I'm doing with this crown. Well, today's episode is all about the Mrs. Exquisite New Zealand 2023 pageant. Welcome to another episode of Showcase on Sevens TV. Now let's get to meet some of the title winners and the person who's going to be wearing this crown. I'm here with Mrs. Exquisite New Zealand 2023 title winner, Thiefi. Hello. Hi. So this pageant had a lot of rounds. And in the final round, when you got this crown placed on your head, saying you're the title winner, how did it feel? It was an incredible feeling. And uh, it was a feeling of a sheer joy and achievement. And I would say it was a feeling of uh, my commitment and the hard work that I have tirelessly done behind the scenes of this pageant. So did you expect yeah. to win it? Not really, to be fair, because my motivation behind participating in the pageant was just for my girls and just to have fun, which this little Miss Exquisite and Mrs. Exquisite has totally shown like how empowering a beauty pageant can be. Mm -hmm. It was a perfect platform for mums like us who just hide behind the scenes, working household chores mm -hmm. and do not go more often and expose themselves like this platform has truly shown me what all I can do it and it has definitely empowered me so yeah it was a sense of that commitment and dedication so I absolutely thrilled to be a part of this pageant and thanks to my family and all the mentors <laughs> who have helped me to reach this achievement and be the title winner the title winner because yeah. <laughs> you got to expect the unexpected yes yeah, so that is amazing that is like something which i know what all i can do now so it all thanks to this platform so for this pageant i'm sure you would have practiced and put a lot of time and effort into this so i'm assuming you would have also faced some challenges yes 100 percent. so the challenges i faced was the intense competition and the time constraint but how I overcome those was with the help of my family members and the support to help me reach this achievement. And yeah, really grateful for that. And another thing I know is that from your family, you're not the only one to win a title. Yes, that is a double counts for a double celebration. So I've got two young girls, Naira, who is seven years old, Alia, who is four years old, and Alia being the title winner of the best evening wear. She was, I'm really proud of it. Like as a first two rounds, she was not that confident walking with the Rosemary on the stage. And the third round, she was like, ah, let go. I can do this. She just flaunting her evening wear and walking on the stage, <laughs> going to the judges. So it was an amazing, incredible feeling to see your daughter having that confidence. So, yeah. And Na on the other hand, Naira, seven year old, she won two titles one best influencer as she loves making videos she has her own facebook page which is called naira gender little miss exquisite nz23 and little miss influencer she's a blogger and definitely the most exciting title of uh, little miss exquisite nz23 so i couldn't be any happier or prouder and definitely the dad is like all the girls <laughs> in the family are winning <laughs> so yeah it was an amazing feeling so how does it feel not only being a title winner, but being the mom of two title winners? Yeah, so it's just beyond words, to be honest. I'm short of words. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that counted for a good celebration. And oh, we went absolutely. out and we just went out and celebrated. So yeah, it's so, an amazing. It's not even a double celebration. Dub it's a triple celebration. Triple celebration, yeah. <laughs> yes, definitely. There were multiple rounds in this pageant, so what would you say was your most favorite round to participate in? My favorite round would be traditional wear round, which uh, I wore my uh, wedding lenga. It's a wedding gown. So yeah, I had to get it uh, altered because of course I'm not in the same way as I was <laughs> like 13 years ago. So yeah, that made me a sense of achievement like I'm wearing my wedding gown so it gives me more confident and I was feeling more of myself and mm -hmm. it was a amazing feeling to wear your wedding gown in a beauty pageant and yeah and there's a lot of memories with that outfit with, as well exactly. special memories yeah so winning this title also would bring on a lot of responsibilities so how would you take this forward so with this title, I would like to support the cause that I believe personally is a mental health awareness. And yes, so I'm looking forward and I want to empower others to 
take this cause uh, as a serious cause because sometimes we do not feel it is happening but it is happening inside you so i would encourage everybody to look after your health you have to put oxygen mask first on yourself before you put it on others so that is my one thing which i would like to promote self care is not being selfish that's very nice and very important as well yeah. so thank you so much and we wish you all the very best in your future endeavors thank you so much thank you it truly was very nice to see how they felt winning these titles and rosemary definitely did put on an amazing show on that note keep an eye out on sevens tv for more such exciting episodes until next time this is barthi signing out <laughs>